New research pinpoints the human cost of global warming. With the world on course for 2.7 degrees Celsius of warming by the end of the century, scientists have found that this will expose around 2 billion people, 22% of the projected global population, to dangerously hot average temperatures. In worst case scenarios of warming over 4 degrees Celsius, half of the world's population could be in unsafe conditions, posing an existential risk to humanity. However, with ambitious climate policies, we can preserve livable conditions for humans and mitigate the inequalities caused by climate change. The research led by the University of Exeter and Nanjing University found that limiting warming to 1.5 degrees Celsius rather than 2.7 degrees would mean five times fewer people being exposed to dangerous heat by 2100. The findings also highlight the disproportionate impacts of global warming for people around the world. For example, the lifetime emissions of just over one U.S. citizen today will expose a future person to dangerous heat, and those people exposed will live in places where emissions today are around half of the global average. India, Nigeria, Indonesia, the Philippines, Pakistan, and Sudan will have the largest populations exposed to dangerous heat if we fail to act. For every 0.1 degrees Celsius of warming above present levels, about 140 million more people will be exposed around the world. So every fraction of a degree counts, and current climate policies, or lack of them, are putting hundreds of millions of people at risk. This is a critical decade. The actions we take now will make a difference between life and death for millions. Our best hope comes from positive tipping points, where smart changes in our societies and economies can trigger rapid transformations toward net zero, helping us create a safer, fairer future for all.